Everybody, welcome back to an episode here on our W Smackdown Show 2007 General Manager Mode. And welcome back to the week where we kind of catch up on it, hopefully. Um, but yeah, this is our special 2007 general manager, like I just said. I'm, of course, Dominic here on the Batterson channel. Let's just jump right into it. So first off, uh, rivalries. I already changed one. Kane versus Carlito because they had a match last week. That's quite it, actually. I mean, Carlito was destroyed by Kane. Oh, no. Why not? <laughs> um, but yeah, nothing else really changed there. Uh, the champions, of course, if you haven't seen last week... Or not last week. You know, I say last week like the previous episode. Uh, you haven't seen the last episode. Bob Lashley is our United States champion, which is lovely because he's fighting Edge in a Battle of the Titans storyline thing. Um, so the idea for this episode is I'm going to try to get Kid Cash up in popularity. And then potentially get rid of Psychosis once the pay-per-view is up. Unless he wins the... the uh, okay, so basically... <laughs> in case... Unless Psychosis and Super Crazy wins the Tag Team Championships, Psychosis is out of here. Because besides that, I don't really have much use for him. Especially if Kid Cash gets his popularity up tonight, which you will see why in a little bit. Um, another thing I haven't really noticed is JBL. He's had like a 50% win streak. And he hasn't had a matchup in a super long time for a title. So he's kind of annoyed now that he's doesn't have a title shot, and he's at like 74 popularity. He's very close to being one of the, one of the top, one, two, what is it, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like, he's, he's number 11. Like, he's very close. He's very close to being on this home screen. So, JBL is complaining about title shots. I'm like, you know what? Fine. You can get a title shot. I don't really care. Also, Giant Nitro, he wants, um, contract. I'll give him that once I have money for that. Um, but yeah, that's really quite it. Just JBL, he's complaining, which is why he's going to be having a United States title matchup tonight. I know last episode we already had a United States title matchup, but I don't, I don't really care. Don't really care, mainly because that got us like a three and a half star matchup. That's really good for some reason. I don't know why that's really good for us, but apparently it is. So, yeah, so let's get into it. So, uh, first off, Hardcore Sync. This is a very good show, by the way. Like, if I don't win this week, I don't know what this game wants from me anymore. Um, hardcore Single No Manager versus With Manager. Shove Grow versus Gregory Holmes with Kid Cash. Mainly because I'm trying to get Kid Cash's popularity up, considering he's like the only heel besides Gregory Holmes in the Cruiserweight division. Um, Joey Mercury with Giant Nitro versus Super Crazy with Psychosis. Mainly because I don't, I don't really care. I don't really care about this one. Um, interview space with Kid Cash. Again, I'm trying to get Kid Cash up there considering he's the only heel. I'm trying to give him some popularity at least because I really want to keep Kid Cash. I don't really care about Psychosis because he's a face and I have like 17,000 faces for our, for the Cruiserweights. Um, now let's get into the matches that is going to be interesting. Uh, submission singles matchup Kane versus Carlito because, you know, they had a match. They didn't have a match like the exact placement of the card too. Yeah, I'm going to change that. I'm just gonna swap that out with the, uh, with the submission or uh, with the tag, not the tag team, the single. This match: Joey Mercury, Johnny Nitro, etc. A steel cage. Shawn Michaels versus Triple H. Now here's the thing: the next matchup after this, I don't know whether I should switch it out. Uh, we'll see though. Shawn Michaels versus Triple H, steel cage matchup, and then tag team normal tag: Randy Orton, Big Show, Rey Mysterio, John Cena. You see. You see my dilemma of if I should switch that out. I feel like I should. Probably. And then the United States ma the title matchup. Edge, Rob Van Dam, apparently. Bobby Lashley and JBL. Because if I remember correctly, Rob Van Dam was the previous United States Championship holder before we traded him off. Um, so I figure, you know, he should get another shot at the title. Uh, Bobby Lashley is the champion, so of course he's gonna be in this match. Edge is his rival, so I have to have him in this match. And JBL, he's been complaining. So, solving problems with one Fatal 4-Way for the United States title match. I think, I think that's a pretty good, pretty good thing right there. Uh, it's, it's just this, though. I'm gonna swap it, I'm gonna swap it. I think Shawn Michaels and Triple H. But then it's like on the previous show, they had that. Y you see... You see my dilemma, right? But then I don't want to swap that out because that's a that's a that's a title matchup. 
and I, I think title matches should be in the main event. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with that. I'm gonna go with this as the card. But then it's like two like looking tag team match things. <sighs> Should I go that? I guess I don't. Sure, that's that's that seems better. Okay, whatever, Wh whatever. Apparently I just like just did something with my voice. Whatever. Oh, and then a merchandise watch of course. Uh, so yeah, let's confirm the match card. Hopefully, in this episode the microphone problem doesn't happen again, like it did last episode when I just cut off at that at the end of the episode. Which was dumb. But yeah, so we're going to be playing uh, these two matches. The Steel Cage and the United States title matchup. I know we already played the last episode's United States title match, but look at this one. Look at this matchup. That's, like, better than the last one. Although, realistically, the other one was a TLC match, and that one was way funnier, but still. Whatever. Uh, Joy Mercury with Johnny Nitro versus Super Crazy and Psychosis. I'm going to be picking Super Crazy and Psychosis. And yeah, mainly because Super Crazy is, like, a 67. Now he's going to have a 68 popularity. Um, Kane versus Carlito. I'm gonna be picking Kane because Kane won last time. Oh no, Carlito wins that one. Ooh, different. Um, Chavo Guerrero versus Gregory Helms with Kid Cash. I'm gonna be picking. I'm gonna be picking Gregory Helms with Kid Cash. Yeah, in a hardcore match, I'll just say. Randy Orton versus with Randy Orton and Big Show because Big Show was the last heel I had on the roster that I could think of. Um, versus Rey Mysterio and John Cena. I'm picking Ray and John. Picking Ray and John. Yeah, Ray and John wins that. So yeah, we're gonna be playing these two Fatal 4 Way US title and then Steel Cage main event. Let's get into it. Okay, baby, let's get into this United States title. Fatal 4 Way rated our superstar making his way to the ring. Okay, he wants a, a second shot at the title he lost last episode. He feels it was stolen from him, considering he wasn't even the one that got the pin. Considering he wasn't even the one that got pinned for the three count. Okay, it was Matt Hardy. So, you know, coincidental storyline that just so happened to work. Why not? Why not? That can, that's, that's the reason the feud's happening. Sure, why not? Rob Van Dam, though, making his way to the ring, okay? Making his return here to Friday Night SmackDown after just two whole weeks. <laughs> like, nothing happened. <laughs> like, really, the only thing that happened was that your title got switched around and you were on Raw for a few seconds and then left because he because he knows because he knows Smackdown's number one <laughs> whatever Robin and making his way to the ring is one of a kind hey that means we get a version one of a kind again yay I just thought I just remembered that I was like oh yeah that's a team heck yeah that makes me happy awesome okay and then of course the United States champion himself Making his way to the ring. There you can see sporting the gold Bobby Lashley. He is our champion. Okay, it looks a little weird, to be honest. The title in the game. I don't know what's wrong with it. It just looks weird. It looks a little more curvy. Hmm. Whatever, Bobby Lashley. He's sporting it. Okay. I think, if I can remember correctly, he's a former military man himself. So, you know, United States title, Bobby Lashley, military thing. I That makes sense. That, that makes sense. Whatever. And then, of course, finally... JBL, the whiny little son of a bow face, bow face, bow leave. I don't think about it, we haven't seen him in a while. Like, he's just been kind of winning simulated matches. Now that I think about it. So, yeah, JBL making his way to the ring there. You can see the Texan billionaire, formerly Brad Shaw. Okay, he whined himself into this matchup mainly because he's 74 popularity, and I don't really want Raw to have him yet. Yet, I might change him out later, potentially, if I see anybody I want. Ken Candy is very promising, if, you know, we can get them to the same popularity. Whatever, anyways. <sighs> Bobby Lashley, JBL, Edge, and Rob Van Dam. Let's get into it. Now, Rob Van Dam going after JBL and Bobby Lashley. Oh, Jesus, German suplex. He really is like Brock Lesnar, Bobby Lashley over here. Okay. And now, Rob Van Dam going after JBL. Going after him, what are they doing? Like, double team maneuver, double clothesline by the Black Brock Lesnar and 420 RVD. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, Jesus, Bobby Lashley going after everybody here tonight. Now, what the? Five Star Fox. Not Five Star Fox, but the Rolling Senton. What is that called again? Shoot. I'm a terrible wrestling fan. Uh, uh I forgot. <laughs> no. RVD, I haven't seen him in a while. I don't know. I'm sorry. The. Sh it's not the Shooting Star Fox. God dang it, now I don't know what it is. Anyways, Brock Lesnar, I mean, Bobby Lashley, beating the crap out of JBL. 
Edge doesn't even know what he's doing anymore. Bobby Lashley still trying to go for the basic. I'm going to keep my title. <laughs> Whatever. Imagine if he won that, though. Freaking less than a minute. And now, RVD. Ooh, beautiful looking kick there. Okay, now what the... What? <laughs> Why did RVD just fall down to the ground like that? I don't... I don't... Un I, just, I don't understand how that happened. But okay, then. Now, Bobby Lashley going after JBL, RVD... Getting destroyed. Pummeled here by Edge. And Edge is now the only person standing up top here, ladies and gentlemen. And then JBL taking him down to the mat there as Bobby Lashley and RVD battling. Now, of course, current United States champion versus former United States champion. See, it's like storyline. <laughs> Did that just happen? Bobby L Edge trying to throw Bobby Lashley out of the ring. Oh, not by Lashley. JBL out of the ring. And then Edge is just like, nah. Uh, Bobby Lashley's like, nah, I'm good. You don't you don't need to throw him out of the ring yet. Maybe I wanted to beat him up a little bit more. <laughs> Whatever. RVD kind of dragging Edge across the ring. I'm not too sure what he's going for. Oh, and then... Oh, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful rolling senton. What is that called? I'm gonna... I'm, I'm about to, like, actually hate myself. What is that? Did he just take down the referee? Uh, sure. Why not take down the referee? Bobby Lashley gonna take use of it? Sure. Why not? And then, oh, onto the former champion. No RVD. And now look at this kick to the face there. JBL thumping the eye of Edge. And a low blow! Low blow! The referee does not even care. That was a, that was a straight low blow. By, by JBL there. Are you actually kidding? And now RVD, look at this! <laughs> Bobby Lashley took down the ref. RVD's just using it. Oh, what? Bobby Lashley was using a chair while the referee was down. And did he just get DQ'd for that? Did he just? Did he just get DQ'd for? Th Who's our champion? I feel like we've had- have we had one of these situations before? I think we have. I think the champion kept it. Um... Edge? Furthering the feud, potentially? I don't even know. Sure! <laughs> Bobby Lashley heel turn question mark! <laughs> Whatever, let's get into it. <laughs> Shawn Michaels versus Triple H Steel Cage. Main event. Okay then. And here we go, everybody. Steel Cage main event. Shawn Michaels, Triple H. This is gonna be a hell of a fun battle. I don't even, I don't even care. That was a weird JBL impression. <laughs> Whatever. Shawn Michaels, Triple H, Steel Cage match. Of course, Shawn Michaels. He got injured, taken out by Triple H. Okay. And so for the past few weeks, Shawn Michaels has been on the tear, trying to get revenge of his former best friend, his former D Generation X. Tag team partner, Triple H. Okay, there you can see Triple H. Water in hand. He is ready for this, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, he is all business here tonight. Triple H and Shawn Michaels. There you can see Booker T just doesn't... He's just like, yeah, I, I'm not on SmackDown. <laughs> I don't care, though. This is an invasion. It's an invasion. I don't even know. Anyways... Hey, it's the escape from the cage door mini game. Oh my god, it's so menacing. You crawl. Crawling in my skin. <laughs> Whatever. Triple H, Shawn Michaels, Steel Cage. Let's get into it. And now look at this. Triple H. Oh, Jesus. Low blow. Low blow already by the game. If that's a, if that's a way to win. I don't, if that isn't a way to win, I should say, I don't know what is. Triple H about to escape the cage. <laughs> Triple Just robbed all of you of a match. I don't even care. <laughs> Triple H. <laughs> Triple H is a low 
Oh, Shawn Michaels and just runs away. He's like, nah, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> and you can see Shawn Michaels like holding his groin like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> what was that? What was that? Was that like 24 seconds? Is that what that was? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I can't believe I just- yeah, 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 by the way, I was playing as Triple H, in case you didn't realize that I was playing as Triple H. I didn't even mean for that to happen, you just low blow him like, imagine if you won this, and Shawn Michaels just never got up! He just never got up! <laughs> Triple H just hit him in the balls and just ran away! <laughs> he didn't take his ball and ran home, no, he punched the other dude in the balls and then ran home. <laughs> Uh, that was great. <gasps> SmackDown got one! 80,000! Yes! Mm. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Trouble in Paris. Shawn Michaels is not happy about management's decision and is very vocal about it. The superstar is ready for a change. What? What are you talking about? What's wrong with Shawn? Chava Guerrero can't buy a match. That oh, was. That was amazing. <laughs> that was an amazing. What's wrong with Sean? Oh, contracts. You want a title shot? Oh crap! Those are all really big names. Shoot. Mm, those are all really big names too that need money. Oh, John. Five weeks. Oh no. Okay, I gotta get the titles first. Gotta get the champions first. Who else? Okay, Chavo Guerrero, Kid Cash. Oh, Kid Cash, whoa! 65! That's what I like to see. Chavo Guerrero, mmm. Can I let go of him? Probably. Super crazy is in a match. Yeah. Super crazy. Oh, I think I can bite all these. No, I can't bite all the contracts. Shoot! No! You are kidding me! Year 163. I only have one. I, ha I have to do something super cheap right now. And I'm sorry. But it's gonna happen. <laughs> Shawn Michaels is 91 though. I don't know. I don't know how he's risen. He got low blowed and Triple H just ran away. How is that giving him a ri Whatever. A rising thing. Okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. Who has a super big pop? Trish Trash. 62 for Tori Wilson. Chava Guerrero, he's 64. Okay, there's a reason I'm doing this. Hold on. This is gonna make a lot more sense in a little bit. So, Mickey James. He, she's got a 10 week contract. There's, there's a reason I'm doing this. I'm gonna trade those. Email. Trade your client. You suck! You absolutely suck. Okay. Um. Here's what I'm gonna do. There's the thing I'm doing. So, Tori Wilson, she's got six weeks left on her contract. Chava Guerrero, he has one week. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna trade those. Trade accepted. And then I'm gonna sell her off. This is gonna make more sense in a little bit. Just hold on. <laughs> Just hold on. <laughs> Don't yell at me. Contract. Release. 44,000. That didn't give me enough money! Shoot! I was hoping that'd give me enough money for Kid Cash again. No, dude. Oh, no. No. Oh, you suck, game. Whatever. What's a rivalry I can do? Do I need a rivalry at this point? Do I need one? Crap, I do. Maybe I can, like... Because the pay-per-view is right around the corner. It's right there in, the next, in like, the next two episodes. So what I'm going to do... <clears throat> I know what I'm going to do. At no mercy, I'm going to have... How many members of, of our roster is Cruiserweight? 
out of curiosity. Oh, people are, shoot, I still have to like pay other people too for next week. How many people are two weeks left? Okay, there's not that many. Okay, there's Matt Hardy and Joey Mercury. Okay, so. What I'm gonna do next episode. Not, not next episode. No mercy. We're going to have. Let me see, there's one. Two. Wait, let me end it. There's only. What? What? Um. Oh. I shouldn't have sold Chavo Guerrero. Oh. I didn't realize. Um. <laughs> oh, no. That is not what I wanted to happen. Oh, no. Kid Cash, man. You're 65? Do they have any that's... Is there 64? Oh, no. Are there any that's... Here, this is Vito and Devari. Those are the only two cruiserweights. Oh no, man! I'm gonna have to get rid of. I can't get rid of this rubber because it's two thumbs, man. Oh no! I just accidentally backed myself up into a corner. I was gonna have Kid Cash and then all the other cruiserweights and Gregory Helms fight. At the next pay-per-view. But if Kid Cash is the only other dude that's not being used. Because Psychosis and Super Crazy are being used. Oh no. That's a big, big oh no right there. Shawn Michaels is upset because he needs a title shot. Trust me, I'll give, I'll give you one like next week. Shoot. I messed up. So bad. I'm gonna, we're gonna have to figure that one out in the next few episodes because I'm gonna have to end this episode after that amazing main event. <laughs> but you see, this is what I like to see. These ratings. These are these are evens. These are ratings I'm okay with. I'm okay with those. But yeah, I'm gonna have to end this episode here on our WWE 2007 SmackDown vs. Raw 2007 general manager mode. If you guys liked it, please let me know by hitting the like button down below, comment anything you want to, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. If you have, why not hit the bell to be notified of everything we do here on the Bad Wrestling channel. I am, of course, Dominic, and have a good day from Bad Wrestling. Oh boy! Yo!